55 to Venus, ahem. Heavenly, illustrious, laughter-loving queen, sea-worn, night-loving, of an awful mien, crafty, from whom necessity first came, producing nightly, all-connecting dame. Tis thine the world with harmony to join, for all things spring from thee, O power divine. The triple fates are ruled by thy decree, and all productions yield alike to thee. Whatever the heavens encircling all contain, earth fruit producing and the stormy main, thy sway confesses and obeys thy nod, awful attendant of the Brumal God. Goddess of marriage, charming to the sight, mother of loves whom banquetings delight, source of persuasion, secret favouring queen, illustrious born, apparent and unseen, spousal, lupercal, and to men inclined, prolific, most desired, life-giving kind, great scepter-bearer of the gods, tis thine mortals and necessary bands to join, and every tribe of savage monsters dire, in magic chains to bind through mad desire. Come, Cyprus born, and to my prayer incline, whether exalted in the heavens you shine, or pleased in odorous Syria to preside, or o'er the Egyptians' plains thy car to guide, fashioned of gold and near its sacred flood, fertile and famed to fix thy blessed abode, or if rejoicing in the azure shores near where the sea with foaming billows roars, the circling choirs of mortals thy delight, or beauteous nymphs with eyes cerulean bright. Pleased by the sandy banks renowned of old, to drive thy rapid two-yoked car of gold, or if in Cyprus thy famed mother fair, where nymphs unmarried praise thee every year, the loveliest nymphs who in the chorus join, Adonis pure to sing in thee divine, come, all attractive, to my prayer inclined, for thee I call with holy reverent mind.